how to create a order form in Google Forms. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can create your own order form from Google Forms. It is very simple and easy to do. All you have to do is to uh, follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be guided to the right way to get your order form. Now I am going to Google Forms, then I have to select my account or my Google account. Then I will go ahead to this platform or this landing page. Right here we have some preset templates. I am going to create my template from scratch. I am click a blank form. Then right here we have this form uh, without a title. I am going to, for example, set the settings. I can make uh, for some settings for the responses. You can, you have to get the right here the email addresses. You can uh, send the responders a copy of their response. Yes, of course, this is a demanded. You can uh, allow response editing. It is up to you to accept the editing of the uh, orders or something like this. For me, I don't accept some changes of after they have submitted the form because that will make some of the some of the work complicated you can put um, the required sign in limited to one person and right here uh, this is for the settings i'm going back to the questions now we have here the email address i can i am going to put for example order form and put the name of the order order form or for example for t-shirts for the shirt or for example summer like this summer t-shirt t-shirt and it will be good to go right you can put it right here on bold it is up to you can also uh, change the uh, the font later now I we, we are going to put the form description here is a order form for you for example to choose or to choose or customize or customize to mice like this the customize I'm going to put this customize the order your order like this your order like this and you are good to go now you can put it on bold or it is up to you here the email address is uh, required now the question right here we have a question i can go ahead and modify this question i can put it for example as a paragraph or a multi-choice i am going to put for example the short answers this is a question about name the name you have to put the name right here i am going to put it as a required right here i have uh, i am going to add another uh, question which is for example for the short test for a short answer uh, family name for example name family name family name like this and i'm going to put it required i will i will add another question here i'm going to put the city like this a short answer required and here uh, address 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 like this it is required to put this one and also right here I can put for example phone number phone number like this and put it required I am going to move this uh, slide for the uh, after here after the name and family name I'm going to uh, put for example add another question which is right here I'm going to put it below this this address below it I'm going to put the address above this now the question is let's go ahead and put for example the uh, style style let's go ahead and put this style I am going to put it as required you can put right here the choice and I will put, for example, multiple choices. I am going to put multiple choices, or you can put a, a checkbox. It is up to you to choose, or you can put a multiple choice grid. I'm going to put here the rows and column. Now, let's go ahead and put, for example, casual. Casual. Uh, I am going to put, for example, you can add 
something on the column you can add whatever you want you can add a row you can add right here a column also you can put I am going to put for example casual right here we have the casual I'm going to put this one green for example uh, let's go ahead and put normal normal here I'm going to put v-neck v-neck like this like that. And this for the row you can put also a row for it or it is up to you I'm going to put for example add another question which has the size I'm good like this put it as bold right this I'm going to put this also bold the question right here the uh, multiple choices now I'm going to put add all I'm going to add all of these uh, sizes it is suggested now I am going to put for example let's add another question which is the color let's go and put color we have the color right here I'm going to put uh, white add an uh, option uh, green or gray and add another option which is let's go ahead and put for example uh, green these are the type of the colors that we have you can add a photo for example let's go ahead and add the style right here I'm going to add a photo to the style I'm going to upload click on browse then I will go ahead and add something in here I'm going to put let's go ahead and see the product that we have right now we have this one for example this is the style that I am going to put the image on this is the style and for the size, for the colors you can put uh, every every aspect to each other for example let's go ahead here we have the uh, the white one I'm going to put a white a white model this is for the white one this is the white one for the gray I'm going to upload an image for the gray model right here this is a let's say that this is a gray model now I'm going to let the photo for this and for the green one I'm going to add also a color or a photo for it which has a green sweater now we are right here this is the green one I'm going to see it uploaded and we are good to go now I can also add the price of each model I can add also here uh, I can add an option right here when I click on gray it can add multiple options for uh, this one I can also put a multiple choice grid this is the row one uh, right here the prices for example prices I can add a column for the prices it is up to you you can put the right here the uh, rows here the, these are the columns and here are the rows let's go ahead and put for example uh, uh, let's add now let's add a price for each one or we can add right here I am going to put for example the price right here the XS is five dollars for example the s is for let's go ahead and copy this I'm going to copy it right here now these are for the prices like that and for example that was not what I wanted to do here we have the uh, spaces or the dashes I'm going to repeat this also and this is very simple now we have here the photos the models and everything right here you can put some rows for example you can put the uh, the rows of the color right here it is up to you when you finish setting everything up all you have to do is uh, to click on send but before that I am going to customize the color for example for the header I am going to put a uh, for example this one this is a pacifico font i'm going to use the pacifico for for the questions also and also for the text right here now we can add a background color i can choose an image for example let's go ahead and upload a image i'm going to put a image of my store or my logo i am going to put 
choose the image that I have created using Canva and we will be good to go. This is the image right here. It contains a logo that I have used on a t-shirt design. I will wait for it to upload and you can adjust the uh, right here the everything that you have. It is not uh, put for this but we are good to go. I am going to click and add this part only for the header it will be uploading right here we have a image you can put your image of the store I can put for example a color this is a good color this is a good one you can choose a background color right here and after we have set up you can preview the order form by clicking on the I right here and we are good to go here we have the email name family name everything is in order also we have these rows and prices we have this this you can choose both of these and you are good to go these are the colors and these are everything when they finish everything up they click on submit and you will receive the order right here on your email and they will see a confirmation email on the sending space that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you on the next one